is going on you guys it is your boy mz here guys i have a humongous announcement that it is a first time ever on this channel i'm wearing a tank top and it's not even only any ordinary tank top it's a ua high tank top so yeah because it's hot as hell up in the northeast for any of my northeastern people that are living up here yeah it is we're, we're getting hit with a heat wave and it's been pretty bad for the last week but Nonetheless, it is summertime, and speaking of summertime, and it is going to be one of the biggest animes of the summer, we are almost close to a month away from the highly anticipated second season of JJK. Guys, I can't tell you how very, very excited I am. I have been saying that I do believe JJK is probably going to be one of the standout animes of this year. JJK is coming in with some heat. With hearing that they're going to be displaying both of their best arcs in the entire series, so we're just going to have to see what is going to go down July 6th. I can't wait to re-watch the series because I do want want to re-watch the first season uh most of you guys remember that we watched it in dub so i do want to see it in sub i want to see the whole 25 24 however many episodes it was i want to see it all in the sub and just really see what i've been missing and i saw the movie in sub very very good so i just cannot wait for season two but we're not talking about jjk we are not talking about demon slayer either we are talking about assassination classroom and what a post credit scene it was last week where we are getting introduced to more characters we're getting introduced to two characters that i have no idea what i'm in store for but they're basically joining the class so add them to the list of all the other characters i have to kind of remember and just focus on but who knows like there's not that many characters that they're entirely shoving in my face for this show there's only certain characters that i will be able to focus on but let's see how they're gonna stack up to the amount of characters that i've already been trying to like grasp in this show let alone with karma okada sugano like just names that i could just bring out there right now so we're gonna see what happens in this episode and yeah let's just get straight in into it guys if you are new to the channel you guys like my rash like subscribe comment down below and if you guys video notified i release those videos definitely smash that notification bell but with that being said let's get right into the episode oh yeah i forgot they got back from their field trip with their new track site in the back of the freaking building isagai i think that's what his name was something about a transfer student how about students? Weird, they got professional killers our age, don't you think? Maybe the teacher thing has gotten too obvious. We all saw how that cover worked out for <laughs> Professor Mitch. Yes. Have you made a pick? Dude, what are you, a ninja? Naturally, I was curious, so I figured I'd hit Mr. Karasuma up for some photos, you know? Bruh, don't... Oh, it's a girl? Whoa! You already made her your background. <laughs> you already made her her background. <laughs> what? what? Think she's here yet? My money's on yes. My money's on yes. I hope to God. Is that a... Is that... I don't know. Whoa. We got a robot in the class. It's come to this? Okay. <laughs> As you probably already figured out for yourselves... This is our new transfer student. The Autonomous Intelligence Mixed Artillery on loan from Norway. Does she have an actual name? It's nice to meet all of you. Thank you for having me. Mr. Karasuma is so over it. Not making smart ass comments about this would be the hardest thing I've ever done. <laughs> I'll thank you not to laugh. This is a serious deal. Welcome to E Class, Autonomous Intelligence Fixed Artillery. Thank you, Karasuma. Yeah, I certainly. This is just gonna add another effect into the show. I don't know. Three characters in our story, one is already dead. So what how is it supposed to attack? What do you mean? I could think of some ways. But I'm excited to see what they are. Whoa! Oh, it's a mech! Somewhat! It has weapons! Okay. I don't know how that's. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how that's possible. Recalculating trajectory, correcting angle, entering auto evolution phase. What? <laughs> you want to be cocky? Oh my god. 
I bet he's doing so much while he's moving too. Block with shock. Whoa! Okay, he wasn't able to dodge all of it. Ah, that's smart. I think that's the closest we've ever seen somebody come to, like, at least touching him. You better be ready. <laughs> what the hell, man? Koro's actually going to have to put up a, f not put up a fight, but just actually try. Oh my god! <laughs> the amount of firepower this thing has! Do you really honestly want to call her a girl? Really? Yeah. <laughs> and they gotta clean up the BBs! Hey, hot stuff. How about you help us out? You got a vacuum cleaner in there or what? Fine! <laughs> Just shut off. Dude, please. She's a computer. Just give it up. Bruh. Second period. Is this gonna be happening every period? How are they going to be able to learn or, like, do anything else? What the... I cannot take out my guns in these restraints. I must ask that you remove them. I don't know if that's a good idea. That's, that's kind of smart. Responsible, sir. These restraints are tantamount to harm. Clearly, we're in direct violation of your agreement. Ooh. It was me. Oh. It says I can't give you a hard time. Ooh. Especially if you're going to be a pain in the ass and shoot up the place every two seconds. Why bother trying to explain it to a machine? She can't understand. It's nothing personal. We'll bring you after class. Let's see how their relationship kind of starts. You're trying to learn here, too. Exactly. Poor programming arrest. Probability of achieving assassination goal by fixed deadline significantly decreased. Requesting immediate assistance. Requesting... Go crying to mommy and daddy. Oh. Oh. It's no picnic being the new kid, but if we can just find a way to make the other boys and girls warm up to you, what do you mean? What do you mean? Do you appreciate why the other boys and girls are foiling your assassination attempts. For starters, they're here to learn, and your methods are. They're here to do the exact same thing you are here to do. There's only one difference. You're a damn AI. <laughs> I have just the thing for you: additional RAM and a cache of. Addition. He got her RAM. What the hell? Explain. Teamwork simulation software designed to help you bond. He literally got her. We want that probability break. Accepted. In general, working well with others is an important ingredient to. He's teaching a computer, an AI. He had training already set for her. Now yeah. you opened fire on me yesterday, I knew that unquenchable thirst for knowledge was something I simply had to nurture. Your That's crazy though. It's Seeing the amount of potential in her and just I mean, it's an AI I'm talking about, but still no matter what, with how close she like came to hitting him. It's good to know, probably. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> Think she'll be here again today? Sheesh. Probably. What do you say we go and complain to Mr. Frost? I'm curious on what she is going to offer them now. What's going to kind of happen now? Is it me or does she look like bigger? Bigger. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Hi there. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Wait. I felt it might improve relations between you. Whoa. Whoa! What? Great! Now all the guys are not gonna stop simping. Great! Huh? Well worth the expense. How does a teacher drop that kind of coin off student? I think it's 
<laughs> he went through all of that, but let's see. Notice how the eyes are different, but it's still the same model. <laughs> Don't be fooled, guys. She's still just a computer. The octopus might have given her an upgrade, but that's all. The octopus gave her a full body. <laughs> Once a box of bolts, always a box of bolts. She doesn't even have free will. Damn. You see the clouds in the back on how they changed? Oh my god! When you put it like that, I sound like a total douche! I'll try harder. I promise. Koro Sensei showed me how to take your feelings into account and work together. So I won't try to assassinate him without you. In fact, I won't do anything unless I have your full consent. That way, this is crazy. Don't be deceived. Beneath that sunny disposition and that adorable willingness to please, her bloodlust is perfectly intact. I made sure of that. Yay! Yay! As she pulls everything out! I have no doubt this young lady will make a formidable ally. What in the world? Sensei can't do? I mean, he just gave a machine the ability to make friends. I don't know what else to say. Long, thin rods and short, fat what? Anyone? Sugiya, you know this. Without in your text this dude's so out. What is she doing? She's giving him the answers. Excuse me, autonomous intelligence. Oh, she caught him. <laughs> She's making friends. That's what you wanted, right? <laughs> Autonomous intelligence fixed artillery. It just sounds weird. Huh, you got that right. Well, we gonna name her. What's autonomous in Japanese? Jiritsu? Yeah, Ritsu! Ritsu! Great! It was a guy's name in Mob Psycho, but we're calling this for a girl now. Never mind. Ritsu, that is going to be weird. This new personality is a programming quirk, not the new one. The machine doesn't have free will. Where she goes from here, well, that's essentially not up to us. Mm -hmm. It's up to whoever made her. Hmm. Huh. What? What is this nonsense? Good evening, Master. I'm having so much Master. fun here. Thank you so much for letting me be a part of this. Mission. Inconceivable. What kind of whimsical trash is this? These additions have nothing whatsoever to do with her intent. Oh course. no. We'll overhaul her immediately. What? So everything that is an assassination related. This machine uses the same AI programming as the Aegis combat system. What? Analyze her surroundings and calculate the most efficient way to proceed in a fraction of the time it would take a human. They're going to completely ruin her. In effect, she will change the face of war. This mission is the linchpin of our market strategy. The reward money is peanuts compared to the revenues in store for us. I don't know what... I don't know what's going to happen now. Regardless of your improvements, remember this. Your master's word is law. Keep to the business of a... Unless they're just... I don't know what their plan is or what they're adding to her. I don't know. The red eyes are back. And everything's back. Upgrades will be considered a breach of your agreement, not to harm us. Damn! And as for you, tie her up again and you pay damages. Because if we break it, then we buy it. <sighs> so how is this fair to anybody? I have no choice. Since when have I been in the business of appeasing parents? My students' needs come first. Yeah. So if she's been, like, downgraded, she's gonna spray the place with BBs again. Right? All day. All day. Every day. Every single couple seconds. Here we go again. Wait, what happened? They take the gut. You wanted me to make flowers, didn't you? Okay. When Koro Sensei upgraded me, he made a total of 985 improvements to my functionality. Yeah. My master determined approximately 95% of these improvements to be irrelevant to my purpose and deleted them. But after analyzing the effectiveness of cooperation, I calculated that the highest probability of success 
success would be achieved by maintaining these improvements. Hmm. Ergo, I hid what I could in an area of my memory left untouched by the purge. Nice. Outstanding! Hmm. Great suit. Does this mean... Yep, I have free will and... Hey! Fantastic! There we go. Hell yeah. If my information's right, I think I'm being what they call rebellious. <laughs> <laughs> that is crazy. I just a junior high student. And so E class. Wow. Another ally in the fight to assassinate our teacher. Twenty seven assassins in all. If you were to tell me that an AI would be in the What the fuck? Whoa! I don't know where either, because she just interrupted me. But God damn it, I just lost my train of thought. Thanks, Professor Bitch. I assume this is a post credit scene. Dark near future. I don't know what's going on. Sonic Ninja? I don't know what the hell is going on. Is this like a TV show? Here I am. I don't know what's going on, guys. Corruption. Is this... What the fuck? This may not even be anything related to the show. I don't know what the hell is going on. Is this like an ad? What the hell? Sonic Ninja. Liars should be cut in half. I don't know... Great, she's Netflix subscription. I don't know anymore. Let me just get into the discussion. Here's what I was going to say. If you were to tell me that an AI would join class E and basically have the opportunity to like become an actual maybe future character and developing character in this show where she'll be able to actually learn something and actually be prominent. I let alone just the A part of like the AI part. I wouldn't have expected anything like that. And with this episode being like that, Definitely had me mostly speechless for some of it because I just could not comprehend everything honestly that was going on just with everything that we were getting in this episode with, what do they call her? Oh yeah, Ritsu. That is gonna be interesting knowing that my favorite anime is Mob Psycho and Ritsu is Shigeo's brother. Now knowing that this girl is gonna be called Ritsu, that's gonna be maybe a little bit to get used to. So we're just gonna have to see how that goes. But at least for the character development of this character, AI, kind of whatever you wanna call it, like it was really interesting because it really does show how much, even though this is a computer, this is an AI, this is an artificial intelligence, that even though, like even that, Koro Sensei still acknowledges her as this thing, as an actual student. Like you are my student at the end of the day. And right now you are my transfer student. So I will like care enough and actually like go beyond to make sure that to help her out with whatever she needed as well. He gave the girl Ram. He gave the thing Ram and extra like things that she'd probably love or love to have or just all of that. It, it's really crazy to just see that, that they brought in that in this show. And I don't know how prominent this character is going to be. It's kind of the same thing like Kanzaki. Like they introduced her a couple episodes ago. I don't know how prominent they're going to be in this show or if they're going to lead into something pretty big or I don't know. But we're going to see. We're going to have to see. It was really crazy that this honestly did happen. It was luckily enough that she was able to like be rebellious, so to say, and have the ability to store that saved data inside of her. So just or, or in a safe place that she's still the same now. She's the same. She's Ritsu in this show. That's really much all I could say with this episode. I'm really, really shocked that this episode was kind of like this. I was not expecting anything like an AI to become in this show and with this character that we were supposed to be getting to be an AI. So it's very, very interesting. Let's see where honestly it goes. I think we're supposed to be getting another character because they did say two students that were gonna be coming into here. So we may get introduced to the other student in the next episode. Let's just see. The show brings up the craziest things so far, and yeah, I, I still like the show, and I haven't really had a problem with any single episode, and it's just really much all I could say. I can't really say anything more about this episode, but let me just say, thank you guys for watching my reaction. You guys are excited for the rest of Assassination Classroom, and you guys like the channel, like, subscribe, comment down below, and as always, my name is Umzi, and I am Mal.